What is going on lads? I'm at Sino and today we have got a Mario Balotelli player review. I did play him in a 5-2-2-1 Sevilla team and yeah, crossing to him was just unreal. And his strength and heading combined were just such an amazing combination. He could bully past defenders with his dribbling, with his runs and he, with his strength mainly because he was so strong but his heading was decent and his strength was just unreal and that's really what I thought about Balotelli. If he didn't have his strength, he wouldn't be the player that he is because he was just so good due to his strength. And I can't stress enough how good his strength was. He had enough pace to do a good job and I really like that. And his movement, as you can see by that goal, I know it's a pretty rubbish rebound. But if you actually analyse it, he's moving in and out of defenders, trying to anticipate it. But moving in, now he's coming back out because he's just anticipated it really well. And his movement there, which is fantastic, and you're going to see it in another clips. His movement really was good and I do love a striker who likes to make runs and likes to give other players an option. As I've used strikers before who are just static and you have to give them sitters. They're good at finishing like Mario Gomez but you're going to have to put it on a plate to them. And yeah, th this was a pretty good shot. Just quick feet to get the ball out of his feet and get shot away. And yeah, I thought he was pretty good. His finishing was really decent, was really good. But his shooting from outside the box power strikes weren't really that good he, he was a good finisher i probably said this wrong he's good at finishing like finesses and inside the box but outside the box with power strikes he wasn't the best and that goal from Quadrado was fantastic and you're thinking well that's n has nothing to do with balotelli again his movement he runs away to the sides and that drags away two defenders and that gives him the space and generally little things like that really made him a good player and this goal here this is absolutely fantastic on the half volley he bangs it into the top corner I was just uh, to be perfectly honest when I put over the top ball I knew I was going to hit it first time and I just had confidence that he would score and it was good players you could see movement barging past the defender to get onto the end of the ball and yeah that really summed up Balotelli and I did like him, but to be perfectly honest, I paid 30,000 coins for him, and I don't think he was worth that. So I feel we can get someone like Mario Gomez who can do his, a good job as him. Lads, I did have a screen at the end where it says pros and cons, but that kind of mucked up and it wasn't working. So I'm just going to sum up now. Balotelli has got good pace and movement and strength, and that really sums him up for me. Value for money wise, if you've got the money, I would pay for him, but. If you haven't got, if you've only got like 35k and only just got enough Balotelli, I wouldn't buy him. Anyway, lads, if you have enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment who you want to see me review next, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.